Um, you asserted your dominance early in both matches with speed maneuvers. Whether it's a blast double, or just taking him down and making him return. Mike Mott's an NCAA champion. He's really good. He's tough. But just so much quicker than him. And it's obvious. There's two speeds out there, right? Like, yeah. tremendous opponent like Mike. I mean, you're so much quicker. Yeah. You're substantially smaller. Like, probably got 10 plus pounds on you. For sure. But, but speed kills. And, you know, Lee Fritz talks about him. He's going to scorch him. He's going he's gonna to lightning him. He's going to whatever the words he uses about you. Um, Kills him. Is that it? I think it's uh, speed, obviously, but I think it's the game planning, too. Uh, making sure I don't get underneath him or play the the tie-up game for too long. Uh, staying out, picking my, my shots. I uh, don't want to get stuck underneath. So I think it's game planning. Uh, blessed with the coaches that I have. Uh, coach me around the corner, seeing, seeing what's best and what my opponent has. So I think it's a little both. How long after the Open did you start thinking 92? Um, as soon as I found out, which was the next day that I could wrestle 92, that decision was made. I just wanted to continue wrestling, and you know, I think God just blessed me with the, the opportunity to be able to wrestle in 92s. He's blessed me with so much. Uh, my family, my Adidas family, Sunkiss family, uh, you know, my training partner, my coaches, uh, just everyone that loves and cares for me. I think put me in this position, and. You know, 92 was a blessing. You know, wrestling is such a humbling sport, and I feel like I grow after after my losses. So, taking that loss is good. Thank God it's this year because obviously the my top goal is to be an Olympic champ. So I got a year, a year to uh, continue wrestling, continue to grow, and get those experiences. Hopefully, get a little bigger too on the on that part. So, I'm just very happy. No, no, just a little bigger, just to solidify my weight class for for 86 kilos. Like I think I weighed in like four or five pounds under for for this for the world trials. You know, I'm not big. People think, you know, I hear the comments, oh, he cuts too much weight. That's why he gas. It's just just wasn't on top of my game. And uh, Brooks was a better man that day. But I think if I wrestled the way I did at the world trials uh, and today, no one could touch me. I just gotta. Wrestle at my best when when the time comes. How do you feel being up in '92? I feel good. You know, I could even tell the difference. I remember making the jump from in high school from 106 to eventually my senior year 182, and I felt the difference. And I, I felt that same difference again, uh, going from '86 to '92. Just the speed, and it helped me a lot to get to the shots that I want and get to the positions that I want for sure. For sure, I think so. I think more of my strength is going to come, but obviously I want to keep that speed and hopefully I could grind out some matches. I know it's going to be tough. Not all of them going to be 9-0, 9-2 like this. So just, I just love wrestling. I mean, I'm going to want to win every match I could, but as much as I could lose right now, going into you know the world trials is going to be good for me. Right, yeah. Thank you.